Hi, Michael Hurwich here for CreativeCow.net with a tutorial on the new color match effect in Sony Vegas 12. We'll also be looking at the LAB adjust effect, which you can use with that, and at the new ability to mask effects in Sony Vegas 12. So I'm starting out with the video preview window open, the project media window open, and the trimmer window open. If these aren't already open, you can open this with Alt 4, this with Alt 5, and this with Alt 2. I also have two clips already in the timeline. This is my green pond clip, and here I have the beautiful shoreline clip. I want the green pond clip to look more like the beautiful shoreline clip in terms of color. Especially I'd like the water here to look more like the water here. So the first thing I'm going to do is to put the beautiful shoreline clip into the trimmer, and I'll just drag and drop that. Then I'm going to select the green pond clip and click on the effects button here. So it already has the Sony category open and it already has the color category open. And the one I want is Sony color match. And I'm also going to click on the Sony LAB adjust and then click OK. So those two have now been applied to this green pond clip. The clip looks exactly the same as it did before because I haven't actually applied the adjustments yet. I'm going to get out of the project media here just so this can be a little larger. So this is my color match that's been applied here. I have to tell it what I want to match to. And that's right here in image source. So I have a number of options. I could choose an image from the disk, from the clipboard, from the screen, but I'm going to say use trimmer image, which is the one I just put over here. And as soon as I do that, you can see that this turns much bluer. So I actually like that for the water. If I turn this off, I can see that this has achieved the effect I'm looking for. Unfortunately, it's also turned this rock and the tree trunks and the grass a lot bluer than I'd like them to be. So this is where the masking is going to come into effect. So I'm going to click here. So I'm in the Event Pan Crop panel and click on the Mask checkbox here. So it's asking me whether I want to apply this to effects. I'm going to start off and say no but later on I'll change that. Now I've actually had some issues with applying masks here. But one thing I found can work is to first apply this oval mask and then edit that. So that's what I'm going to do. What I'm going to want to do is to mask out the grass for the effect. But to start off with I'm just going to apply this oval mask. Then I'll go to my pen tool here add a point there, add a point there, choose the edit tool, drag that up, drag that up, pull these over to the side. So now I've basically eliminated the grass from the scene. You can see it's dark up here. Now I'm going to say yes, mask the effects. Click here, and say yes. And right away you can see that this is no longer blue. Let me enlarge that. So again, if I click here and say no, don't mask the effects, that just becomes dark. If I say do mask the effect, then only the effect is masked out of the upper portion. So this is basically what I want. I want this water to change color, and look more like this, but I don't want anything to change up here. So now I'm going to go on and look at the LAB adjust. So here I can adjust lightness, I can adjust channel A, which goes from green to magenta, or channel B, which goes from blue to yellow. So for example, if I go down this way, I make it bluer and bluer. If I go up this way, it gets more yellow. And you'll notice it's not affecting the grass. I'm going to get out of the trimmer here since I don't need that anymore. 
I can double click here to push this back to zero again. So let's say that I like this pretty well, but I'd like to be even a little bit bluer. So I'll just drag this down. I can make it very extreme. Maybe I'll make it just a little bit bluer there. And there I have my effect. So that's the Sony Color Match effect. It's new in Vegas 12, as is the LAB Adjust, and also the ability to directly mask effects. Hope this has been helpful. Thanks for tuning in.